Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Rad Tarot and this is going to be Pisces Sun, Pisces Moon and Pisces Rising weekly tarot, tarot and Lenormand reading for uh, September 3rd to September 9th 2018 now um, while I'm shuffling I want to remind you guys that should you go for a personal reading with me my website it is written down below in the description of the video and there you can find the full list of my services as well as uh, the um, <clears throat> their pricing so um, as I'm finished shuffling we're going to the tarot spread first and four position spread first position is about the topic of your week Pisces second position is about the core of the situation here third position takes on the challenges you have to take care of or you have to face in uh, this week and the last one is about the guidance <clears throat> the tarot gives you how to be most beneficial in this week uh, so uh, the first card here as the topic this is going to be the four of wands a very important cycle of development is near its end so you are going to reach a, a certain completion what is important with the four of uh, wands here is is that this is most likely a um, a cycle which you have worked for a quite a long time and you have toiled, uh, toiled behind it for um, uh, for a lot of hours and as well the toils were uh, immense most likely at a certain points as well they were against the odds very important however with the four of wands is to recognize at the very finish line before uh, before you actually cross it uh, to um, observe are they not um, aren't there any uh, matters that you are kind of overlooking you know because as you are on the finish line you are very thrilled and you may uh, kind of rush yourself to cross it but that may leave some issues or some negotiations you know or in general even something that you have planned to be kind of overlooked and under the cycle of development that doesn't mean ending this is a completion it's very different and I will give you an example that could be the cycle of development of you planning a project or planning your private business okay so you finish that cycle of development you complete it with the planning and the next cycle of development is about initiating and establishing your private business so this is not an ending okay this is a completion of a certain step or a certain cycle of development that you have placed quite of a, a, a work behind it right that would be as well that you have chased a certain person of uh, of interest here uh, all right and this week is the week where you and them are going to establish a um, a certain form of relationship something that kind of satisfy you it may not be the very romantic one that you want all right but it will be something that you have fought for all right it's just it's very important to again not allow uh, some kind of like minor details to elude you here or even uh, important matters to elude you when it comes to the four um, <clears throat> to the four of wands and one needs to seek a, a full seal full completion of that cycle of development so nothing has to be overlooked I I cannot stress you enough but at the very least this is a card which points that that week for you Pisces is, is going to be a week for a, a celebrations I already said why you are going to celebrate here it is because you have done a great great job and the core of the situation of it is the nine of wands so that card here speaks that you have recognized you know uh, what what needed to be changed into your approach into your plan and into your work in general for example into your chase of that person of interest into your approach toward your um, toward your project or toward the colleague of yours so in generally you you understood what you were doing wrong you changed that all right so you made those con conscious adaptations um, and aligned yourself with the situation and the result is um, is there I mean you now will have those rewards that you were uh, that you were after you're going to have that milestone 
and uh, this is basically the repayment here that you're going to face in uh, in this particular week and uh, how this is going to unfold further uh, afterwards well that will depend how you start the next cycle of development that is the thing with those cycles of developments that they are marking the ending of the reading rather than the very start of the reading but the very least guys that week is going to be a week where you should feel proud of yourself as the both cards are pointing that you kind of like managed you know the whole situation on your own and you did it with quite of a pseudo acute pseudo sense of um of either business or of either human nature in case you are chasing somebody uh, the challenges however that you have to overcome here is going to be the tree of swords very peculiar that the tree of swords is appearing uh, at that very moment um, <clears throat> because the tree of swords regards to either a truth or uh, in your case, it may regards to a, a mental cruelty. Now, some people um, I saw in the comments that are asking what is mental cruelty. Well, mental cruelty is when people are offending you. That is mental cruelty. When they are cruel with their mentality, they are talking bad for you in your face, as, uh, insulting you in front of other people, you know, um, <clears throat> making you look bad in front of others as well, etc, etc. That is mental cruelty. Just so they can ruin here the, um, the development of that cycle. Two good things is that I have to say to you about that um, situation. First of all, no matter what, how much they try, they will not be able to ruin that cycle of development of yours. Just on the contrary, the more aggressive they are with their mental cruelty, the more uh, solid you, the finalization of that cycle is going to be. It's just they are going to prove themselves wrong with what they are doing. And uh, also... <clears throat> Uh, it does point that uh, what was I what was I about to say? Oh yeah, uh, that will make you even more uh, determined, you know, to advance with the next cycle of development. Because uh, you know, uh, usually when people are trying to stop you of doing something you are on the right path you know when you are on the right path you are facing difficulties no one is trying to uh, sway you back especially with that kind of a treatment here mental cruelty when you are on the wrong path so if you face difficulties especially from other people um, this week september 3rd to september 9th 2018 you are pisces on the right path and you should push even harder and the last card here points to the uh, guidance that you should adopt we have the hangman and the uh, the change of the perspective should continue so you have understood here how you could have uh, how you could have yeah change a little bit your uh, strategy your performance here align yourself a little bit to the situation so you can make it a little bit uh, so you can accelerate a little bit or to make it with a little bit more ease and the hangman points that the change of the perspective so how you can look at that situation from a different angle and maybe adopt different um, different approach should continue further because the hangman what the card says is that there are delays until one does not reach a, a different perspective just like the man is hanging on the branch of the tree the man sees the world upside down from a different perspective you know uh, if you are sitting straight you know you're seeing the world uh, uh, kind of like you know upside and uh, if you are hanging with the um, upside down, you are seeing the world upside down, which is with a totally different perspective. That is the meaning of the scene of the hangman here. And as the hangman adopts that kind of a uh, posture here, uh, it is because uh, this is from the um, body language. And it is a, a posture of uh, not incapability, but helplessness, unless the man recognize that this feet of his is not bound to anything and the mind can change 
uh, its posture. So yeah, you need to kind of like um, <clears throat> try or not try, but try to see the things from a different light, if that makes sense to you guys. And uh, if, um, <clears throat> if your situations are kind of like unbearable, just leave them aside, try to do something else because the hangman as a guidance promises you that everything will come with its time. So uh, if you have the patience to wait enough, your problems will be resolved on their own accord. And uh, that was for the uh, tarot reading. So now let's see what Dylan Norman has to say as a uh, event that you should either look forward to or try to avoid. All right, so we do have the fox, which either stays for a trickster or a worker, one of the two. It's it's definitely a worker here. We do have the um, the bucket, which stays for a surprise. Something good happens. Uh, yeah, in in business. So um, one more card is what I need. We do have the dog, and uh, this kind of. Uh, these these Lenormand cards could manifest in many different ways, but it's about your business or about your career in general. So should you find yourself jobless, jobless, maybe a a, a worker in a company that is a friend of yours may tell you that uh, you know a um, an open an open uh, a position may open soon, uh, or um, <clears throat> if you are working somewhere that could be a worker who. The, the, who seemed careless until this very moment proves to be someone that can be trusted as well. How this relates to uh, your ending of a cycle of development? Well, it may not end up, as I said, this is the ending of your reading here, guys. I mean, that is the end point of that reading and how you're going to start your next cycle of development uh, will define how, you know, you will proceed on further with your future. That is, I think, something totally unrelated with the tarot cards and its exterior peripheral, like a bonus to... Uh, to to the benefits that you are going to reap and at the very least you will have uh, with whom to celebrate that um, that completion of cycle of development so that being said pisces this was your weekly tarot reading for september 3rd to september 9th 2018 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And again, in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it is my website listed down below in the description of this video. Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.